go to the buildbot.libretto.com then go to stable and search for the latest retro arch release in this case it's 1.16 open it up choose your platform in this case it's windows then 8664 and download retroarch.zip and download retroarch course.7zip now go to your steam library and from here click on top of retroarch manage and browse local files this will open the retroarch steam folder now go to the retroarch.7zip you just downloaded retroarch win64 go to info search for citra or citra lib retro and copy into the info folder open the retroarch course 7zip retroarch win64 course and search for citra lib retro Citra Lib Retro and copy it to the course folder. Now we can start RetroArch from Steam, load the 3DS game. And as you can see, it's working perfectly. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching and happy gaming.